All right, guys, so I grew my account by 83% in two weeks, okay? So 83% in two weeks. All right, so this is it. Yes, so I withdrew 7,000. Yes, I withdrew 7,000. So how did I do it? Let me show you some of the trades that I picked. All right, okay, so the first one is still good. All right, so this is the trade took it on Monday. All right. So I'll use uh, trading view to explain. This is a second trade. This is a second trade. I think this should be Wednesday or Tuesday. Okay. And then uh, this is the same trade. This is the same trade. And all right. So yes, I believe this is Thursday. Yes, Thursday news. All right. So I'll go to trading view. Now, if I change to the line chart, if I change to the line chart, okay. Monday we had this a breakout, okay. Price trading above this resistance, okay. Some of you wonder if it's a resistance, okay. So managing this now, we have a way of identifying resistance. So then I go back to changing the chart type to candlestick. So we traded above this, so there's an engulfing. So this is Monday's candle. This is bearish candle. Okay, this bearish candle is Monday's candle, this particular one is Monday's candle, all right? So on Monday, this was a chart pattern. You have a bearish candle and a bullish engulfing, okay? So now, looking at this, I went to four hour. Okay, so on four hour charts, on four hour charts, right there was this open close okay this open close which is going to be a support this open close all right so mark the open close mark the open close okay and then i go to one hour so my one hour chart my one hour chart this is what the it, we have okay so we have an snrc one okay so we have a strong resistance and opposite it we have a, a drop a rally base rally okay so we had a strong resistance before opposite it we have a rally base rally okay is it enough no then I look through this rally base rally. Okay, and I found a miss. Okay, so the fact that this candle couldn't touch the support down here, okay, gives me that, that tells me that this is a miss and price is going to use this support. Okay, so now my entry is somewhere here and here. Okay, boom, 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 and that's it, that's a trade, so the trade was like this. Okay, down to here, and then targets was this high, because price was definitely going to take this high, okay. So we got here um, and then started going down and I closed the trade. So next day, four hour chart. Okay, so the next day, look at the four hour chart. Okay. All right, so price came back to retest that same level again, okay? Uh, I think I didn't get this one. So I got this buy, okay? I got this very beautiful buy here. So there's an outstanding trade that I want to explain. This is where this buy, what happened? Okay, so here I can easily draw a trend line 
from here i draw the trend line using the, the body of the candle so draw this trend line like this okay so when i draw this trend line like this what i want to see is that there's a first drive okay there's a first drive there's a second drive and the second drive had given me an engulfing so i look inside the engulfing okay so now i decided to start buying from here which was wrong this resistance or this support okay then i started getting drawdowns and then i saw this engulfing so now my entry came on to this engulfing now if i look through this engulfing on 30 minutes okay this is what i see very beautiful one very beautiful candle okay so this is the entry from here okay to okay so we're going to clear all this so minimum target was here okay so this was a minimum target and price flew up to here okay so again i got a sell here i got a sell here still using the trend line all right got a sell here okay so in here not the box okay so this engulfing right i got this sell my take profit was here <laughs> take profit was here right it never came to this uh, support rbs but he used the uh, one above it okay so when it started flying and i, I closed my trade so okay then it got here i got this cell from here okay so this cell from here from here so this is where i made most of my profit okay this range this sort from here to here because i entered several times price came back and this price came back and the take profit and i always take um partials okay so here on this particular uh, line okay there was a daily daily resistance okay so we had a daily resistance somewhere here see this is the daily resistance so price approach it on one hour so you can see one hour okay so on one hour when it approached i was looking at it okay so i was monitoring 15 minutes and five minutes okay so on 15 minutes already right is is we see that we have a breakout okay so there was a breakout on 15 minutes looks like this okay right something small like this okay but i actually entered before the breakout on five minutes okay so i have um some way of entering okay so looking at the resistance i went inside the resistance went inside the resistance and marked the highest point okay so that that is a high risk entry entering without confirmation are we okay somewhere here okay okay so this is the level inside here this engulfing then this engulfing okay so those were the, the highest point okay so when price reached the highest point on 15 minutes okay on five minutes sorry five minutes right i started what selling and interestingly 
I entered a 0.50 lot size here. And interestingly, this is what happened. There was a breakout somewhere like this. Line chart. On the line chart, there was a breakout. This one closed below. Okay, so when it came back here, I think on one minute. Okay, I don't want to go there. In one minute. Okay, I added positions. Okay, so this first move, this first move here from from here to here, I got out. I took partials. When he came here, I added position. I got out here. Okay, so then when he came back here, see this engulfing, right? This engulfing has given a breakout, broken out, right? Coming back. So inside this engulfing, went to one minute. And that, that was beautiful. Okay, went to one minute and then refined to this engulfing and boom. See, so at this point, news was coming. Okay, we're preparing for the news somewhere here. Okay, so I didn't want to predict that it's going to fall. So I closed all my trade and I was waiting for the news. The news came, I never got the news. Okay, so those are the beautiful trade that I took this.